Yep, well, there's uh, no telling that this goal was important. <laughs> Morning, afternoon, and evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Zachary Nolan. Carter Nolan is behind the camera. And tired. Very tired. But we have to wait for no nothing. But anyway, um, so last night's games, a lot of action-packed affairs. Uh, and one of those was a triple overtime game in which the Pittsburgh Penguins defeated the New York Rangers. Um, a huge game in comparison to the rest. Um, but this was a moment in the game that could have swung the matchup the other way, honestly. Uh, the New York Rangers, with under four to go, get a break here coming in. Capo Caco is coming in. I didn't get the name of the defender, which I'm now blanking on. I'm so sorry. But nonetheless, gets the puck. Goes in on a rush there. Tries to create a two-on-one. Break cuts towards the net. Gets boxed out here very well by the defender. That looks then like Latang, by the way. Tang. Okay. No, no, not it's not. Oh, I'm looking at him. I'm looking at him. I'm looking at here. Oh, you're talking about him. Okay. Mm. Carter. Killed a bug. Anyway, <laughs> but he cuts towards the net and honestly tries to go across. He he doesn't quite make it there. Gets to, get takes out the goes down. Takes out the goalie. The defender goes down as well. However, uh, is able to make a beautiful pass. Back to back to Lafreniere, or to, no, not Lafreniere is there to uh, Philip 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 Cheadle. and Cheadle puts that puck right in the empty net, and they all celebrate, and you can't see it, but the ref calls it a goal on the ice, and so what happens is Pittsburgh challenges this for goaltender interference. Now here's De Smith here. Now here's what I'm getting from this these couple first couple angles. Now. It doesn't seem that there's a lot of contact with the Ranger player. The majority of contact, however, is with the, the Penguins' own defender, which could mean that this call could go their way. However, it actually wouldn't. It would be deemed goaltender interference. Now, I think after seeing this angle, this, this angle here, that I understand why. So, for the record... Is the defender pushing um, Capo Caco into the goaltender? No, he isn't. Capo Caco is making an intentional decision to cut across the net. However, he cuts a few seconds too late. If he cut across the net earlier, he could have moved over into the shooting lane and gotten the shot off so it was a straight one-on-one -on -one shot. This is almost a deke instead because he waits so long. Now... It is also important to see that DeSmith has a right to his crease. DeSmith technically has a right to be from here or to be as far out to, as to the top of the crease. Capo Caco can't do anything about it. That's just the rules and how they're laid out. Now, Capo Caco here cuts here. This is the moment because we see the pad is open and the leg is going to drag the pad across the thing, and now, honestly, I would have showed a, a, an angle in between these two shoot shots, but, but the stupid referee decided to walk right across the great camera angle that we have there. But at the end of the day, I don't think, like the, like the Pittsburgh Penguins player doesn't push on Capo Caco. Capo Caco makes an intentional decision to come across the, the and, and people can be like, well, he, the Ranger player has nowhere else to go. Technically, not true. Not true. Technically, Capo Caco could not cut across, or what he could do is pretty much has to stop the play dead there, because he has to make a stop there. He should have made the cut in towards the middle of the net earlier, because the Penguins player is allowed to defend the net, because otherwise, you know, what are we doing here? At the end of the day, there's, it's, it's unintentional contact, but it is still contact, so I would rule this no goal. Sorry, Rangers fans. I know this one's done, but we'll see how it goes in game two. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Uh, don't forget to subscribe if you're new to the channel. Leave a like, all that jazz. And we'll see you next time uh, with some more live streams tonight of the playoff games. Oh, Connor. You'll special to Connor. Connor